In March 2014, the Southwest Power Pool launched an integrated electricity marketplace in its 14-state area of the central United States. This real-time electricity market lowers system costs through more efficient system balancing as renewable sources such as wind are increasingly added to the energy mix. The newly integrated marketplace introduced system-wide balancing where the most economical resources are used to balance the system. The new way of dispatching has had a huge impact on truly flexible gas assets in the market. The effect of this on the Wartzilla internal combustion engines has been dramatic. For example, running hours have grown tenfold and starts have increased from three times a week to three times a day. Clearly, SPP operators value these results. Giving customers precise, real-time market information allows them to adjust their usage for the best price economy. It also helps utilities to balance out fluctuations every five minutes. Market mechanisms in the U.S. are awarding flexibility through five-minute pricing for energy and ancillary service pricing in terms of spinning and non-spinning reserves and regulating reserves. What we see in the five-minute energy prices is a transition from hourly pricing to real-time five-minute prices. These real-time five-minute prices are extremely volatile and they exhibit the need for flexibility through their movements in prices going negative and then extremely positive up to and exceeding $1,000 a megawatt hour. That five-minute transition from nothing to $1,000 is a manifestation of a market signaling the demand for flexible resources to meet a price. The Golden Spread Electric Cooperative in Amarillo, Texas owns Antelope Station, a quick starting power plant consisting of 18 Wurzilla engines. It can fire up to full output with all 18 engines within less than five minutes. This helps Golden Spread to cope with the key challenges they face, such as wind intermittency, water scarcity, and wide temperature variations. We wanted something that would uh Start quick, not only start quick, quick load to the grid, you know, to, to base load when we needed it. We, uh, the small environmental footprint was huge for us, the, uh, not only the air emissions, but the, uh, the water, virtually no water usage, and you're in West Texas, large farming community, so, you know, water, water is key. When the wind dies down, you know, it's, it's not always predictable, and you can't always plan that, and we've got to be able to respond quickly, and we, uh, I guess just to give you a general idea, we start on an average a thousand times a month on these machines at, uh, at Abernathy and not always at, at full load. We could run anywhere from a you know, quarter load up to full load at any given time. May only run 10 minutes and shut down, but all of that is happening to keep this grid stable. According to an Ascend analytics study, flexibility and real-time optimization can boost gross profit margin sixfold using Wurzilla engines compared to traditional gas turbines. Lee County Electric Cooperative's generation plant, located just east of Lovington, New Mexico, comprises five Wurzilla engines. At full power, the plant provides nearly 50 megawatts of intermediate and peaking generation. Wurzilla engines were a natural choice because of their excellent operational flexibility. This is based on their capacity to start up and shut down at very short notice, their low water consumption, and their ability to operate in freezing and hot temperatures. We looked at the uh, Wartzella technology mainly because we were looking at a renewable portfolio standard that we had with the state of New Mexico. And 5% uh, of our uh, energy sales has to come from renewables. Biggest issue was heat rate, obviously. We wanted a, a good heat rate. Uh, the other issue probably was ramping, the ability to ramp. Uh, as you would know, wind energy requires ramping, uh, and, and Wartzilla provided that. The choice of Wartzilla just made sense in economic terms. The cost of maintenance, the, the O&M cost, the, the cost of capital, uh, the, the overall project cost, was uh, evaluated. Uh, the the, the, the uh, contract period, we needed the units to, to match up with a 20-year contract. So we were looking at that as well. Goodman Energy Center in Kansas, owned by Midwest Energy Incorporated, extended their power generation capability from 9 to 12 Wurzilla engines. 
This increased the power plant's capacity from 75 megawatts to 104 megawatts. Goodman appreciates the way Wartzilla works in partnership with their clients. Wartzilla did give us the opportunity to select them to not only just supply the engines, but to develop the entire facility. As we went through that process, we started homing in on Wartzilla. And, and there were a couple of reasons why we really started liking the Wartzilla product and, and the technology they deployed. And, and perhaps one of the most uh, stark contrasts between them and what we saw in, in some other offerings was the way Wartzilla designed the control system, the way that they co-optimized, my words, not theirs, uh, the relationship between operating that engine as efficiently, fuel efficiently as they possibly could and at the same time getting maximum output out of it when you wanted to have maximum output but not allowing that fuel efficiency to suffer if you chose to operate that machine well below its maximum capabilities. And Wartzilla to us appeared to have the best technology that brought all those things to bear Wartzilla's engines boast remarkable ramp rates. They have closed circuit radiator cooling, different cooling water configurations, no water consumption, and excellent operational flexibility. They also boost revenue through balancing capacity and ultra-high efficiency over the whole load range. Wartzilla Smart Power Generation is the best investment case in the SPP area. It integrates wind and renewable energy resources while maintaining lower operating costs and is environmentally sustainable. For 75 years, the Southwest Power Pool has been keeping the lights on for customers across a broad area of the United States. And now, with help from Wartzilla, it's smoothly transitioning into a new, more sustainable and stable future. I'm very comfortable with the technology. Uh, I have not had any reason to believe we're not going to be very successful in the market with, with the Wartzilla technology.